Hello guys, this is Linus Limayenki to Hotel. I'm in the field today. In the framework of the field day, we have a local uh, event. It's a three hours short contest. And today I'm trying to test how is my antenna working? How successful can I be with a, such a simple antenna working on 80 meters making mostly local contacts local contacts so nvis working on 80 meters it seems that the best of all it would be just you know to throw the same 13 meters wires which i'm using for the counterpoise today just to throw it somewhere on the pole on on the, on, on the tree and it, it, it probably would be much more efficient antenna than the five meter long whip. But, you know, uh, the, the, for the rapid deployment task, it's important, you know, uh, to be autonomous, to be independent from any, any surroundings. So, like in this case, I'm only depending on my car. I'm now in the parking lot of the, of the big super, supermarket so and it's not possible to throw anything into these trees they are just complicated to reach to. so in this case the simple whip uh, loaded with two coils in my case works very very well my setup today is my trusty go box and it works very good iso ft891 begali keypad bio -Eno. 20 amp hours battery windows tablet computer and portable keyboard very convenient so far so good i've made more than 10 psos in this square and now i gotta leave to another square switch the radio off I just let it go down into the box. I'm going to switch uh, the uh, N1MM logger off. Yes. And that's it. I'm 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 going to leave the computer in the standby mode uh, in, in order just to save time I'm not booting it up again. So, I put my keyboard in here. And that's it. I'm disconnecting the antenna, putting the galley here. So, and that's it. Now, all I need to do is just to close down the lid. And I will fix also with the, with the seat belts. Now I'm moving to my next destination, maybe some 10 kilometers away from this place, from the first place, is going to be next square. The whole country is divided into more than 300 squares. So and one square is 10 minutes by 10 minutes, which roughly means like 18 kilometers by 14 kilometers. Well, the goal is to make as many as many squares as, as you can during three hours of activation. Here's my setup in the second location. It's not far away from the highway. It's a forest, some forest place. And uh, well, my antenna whip is in place. It took only just a few minutes. The counterpoise goes over down there to this to this uh, kind of a pole marking some i don't know gas pipe or whatever let's see what we have now here on the bands probably is going to be better
I'm in a fantastic field now and there is no trees e enabling me you know to put up the antenna well that one is could be possible it is too far away I, I can I can drive uh, nearby to it because it, the, 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 the small road is just going over there I'm standing now and so here I have the gardener's pole with me at all times very very useful device you know as a uh, pole supporting the rope or counterpoise in this case so my counterpoise is just my 13 meter wire which otherwise I'm using as a antenna uh, so the random wire antenna which works pretty well with antenna tuner but today I use it as a counterpoise uh, probably on for 80 meters I should have used you know something <clears throat> longer like 20 meters or something like that quarter wavelength but well uh, I decided probably it won't make so much difference uh, because 20 meters of wire is already a little bit too difficult to manage if you are especially in the location as I was today <clears throat> uh, in the in, in the parking lot somewhere mm, so uh, 13 meters 13.5 meters actually is is okay the SWR was acceptable all right so we have a resonance on, at 3.58 nearly actually 3.6 and the SWR 3.2, 3.3 actually. So uh, I will need to use an antenna tuner. That's fine. And um, and well, and my antenna today is my trusty five meter long whip, MFJ whip, and uh, base loaded with two coils. One coil is borrowed from my body stick. It's my modified body stick coil. I've been trying to measure and it's, it, it shows around 22 micro Henry's. And the lower coil is a MFJ 40 meter loading coil. Uh, so, and uh, my calculations showed that actually to load the five meter long whip on 80 meter band I need something like more than 30 micro Henry's of inductance so I decided to combine these both two of these like uh, 22 micro Henry's body stick coil and 16 micro Henry's uh, MFJ coil and that proved to be true uh, I did not need both, uh, so to say, fully both coils. Uh, I tapped the lower coil at the fourth tap from the from the bottom, and and it's what the in the exactly in the resonance at around 3.6, and it uh, proved to be working pretty nicely. LY2 Henrikas Portabilos, LY2 Henrikas Portabilos. LY2 Henrikas Portabilos, LY2 Henrikas Portabilos. LY2 Henrikas Portabilos, LY2 Henrikas Portabilos. QSL Kestutis Dudu Yums Tenki Devini Kestutis Du Keturi Kestutis Du Keturi Mano Paskutinis Noves Quadratas Septini Tris Alright guys, so the contest is over It was very very good experience to try 
my shorty shorty five meter long whip on 80 meter band in this field day event so i really surprised by the performance of this antenna i made uh, right i made 53 contacts uh, operating from three different squares and luckily i had no rain which probably seems might come now this was a fantastic experience today proving that even the very minimalistic setup could be very efficient in completing the task and the task today was rapid deployment in three squares and making local QSOs on 80 meter band basically this is a task which could be for the uh, preparedness exercise too so that's it for today guys thanks for watching and uh, please leave your comments in the comment section how was your experience in the field day uh, maybe you've been taking part in the region one field day how did you like it uh, what do you think about operating short whips on low bands so this is something uh, new and interesting and could be very very useful so that's it for today thanks for watching peace and victory for ukraine 73 see you in my next videos this is linus lima yankee to hotel